Hey there, I'm making this video to encourage you to persist when trying to solve problems in life. Problems, problems in living are something that can potentially influence our emotions, how we feel in life. So if we solve problems, then we can feel potentially better than we already do. Even if I already feel great, you know, even if I'm a, you know, decamillionaire and uh, I have all these wonderful, you know, um, different things in my life, and I already feel great, you know, I might have a problem, and if I solve that problem, you know, I might, fe I might feel even better. And I think this applies for pretty much all humans. I think it is sort of part of the human condition, you know, to have problems in living, and then to solve them, we can potentially feel, you know, better than we already do in the present, you know, no matter how good we already feel. That's sort of my personal philosophy, and I think I'm probably right. Um, you know, sort of based out of uh, cognitive behavioral uh, <clears throat> principles. Um, I think it's pretty true. So I would just encourage you to, you know, whatever problems you have in your life, whether they're small problems, you know, pervasive problems, lingering problems, financial problems, social problems, political problems, legal problems, uh, you know, any sort of problem, to persist and persevere when trying to solve it, when trying to fix it, to trying to, to find a solution, you know. And I, th I think in theory there's pretty much a uh, potential solution for you know, pretty much all problems. And of course also when you're trying to problem solve, you want to try and get a uh, sustainable solution. You don't want to get a short-term solution that works, you know, for a day but then causes bigger problems later on. You know, you don't want to put a band-aid on something. You want to get a permanent solution that is, you know, hopefully sustainable. So, um, I think that's very important for humans. Uh, and I don't, I don't, by the virtue of the fact that we have, you know, 30,000 plus suicides a year in the United States, and, you know, tens if not hundreds of thousands of people in jails and prisons, um, you know, if I need money, Breaking a law is not a good solution to getting money. It works for maybe a day or whatever, but, you know, there's a good potential you'll get caught and wind up in prison or jail. So, you know, there are s solutions that are not sustainable. They're not good solutions. They're bad solutions. <laughs> you know, they're temporary solutions. You want a sustainable long-term solution. So... Um, and of course, uh, or ver by virtue of the fact that you, you know, hear about people who are rich and wealthy and that are miserable, you know, I would venture to say that, uh, you know, they have some problems that could use solving, you know, that they might feel better if they did. So, and my point is wherever somebody is, uh, socioeconomically, you know, there's probably problems to be solved. So anyway, I'll end it there. Um, yeah, so persevere and persist, uh, and be creative and yeah. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, watch my other videos, visit my website, and have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or night, whenever and wherever you may be.